In this session, we will learn to measure insulation resistance and wet leakage current of PV modules. At the end of this session, you will be able to know about the insulation resistance, explain the importance of measuring insulation resistance in PV modules, know the significance of wet leakage current test, measure the insulation resistance in PV modules and measure the wet leakage current of a PV module. Did you know? The use of conductors and their insulation is regulated by IE regulations and BIS code of practice. Two fundamental properties of insulation materials are insulation resistance and dielectric strength. They are entirely different from each other and measured in different ways. Damage of insulation can result into loss of power, overheating of equipment and even fires. Insulation resistance is the electrical resistance of the insulation against the flow of current. Hence, insulation resistance to be maintained to ensure safety. Please remember, the insulation resistance quality of an electrical system degrades with time, environment condition, that is, temperature, humidity, moisture, and dust particles. Megometer Mega is the instrument used to measure insulation resistance. It measures high resistance values in megohms without causing damage to the insulation. The measurement serves as a guide to evaluate the condition of the insulation. Insulation resistance testing is used to identify faults to the insulation by testing the integrity of wiring and equipment. The purpose of the IR test is to check for damaged insulation. This can be mechanical damage or damage by heat, overloaded cables. Readings less than 2 megohm indicate damaged insulation. Readings of 2 to 50 megohm are indicative of long circuit lengths moisture and contamination and do not indicate the insulation quality. Here comes the principle behind insulation resistance test. By injecting a known DC voltage lower than the voltage for dielectric testing and then measuring the current flowing, it is simple to determine the value of the resistance. The insulation resistance test is an electrical safety test and shows whether a solar module offers adequate insulation. Let's see IE rules regarding voltage drop concept. As per IE rule 48, the insulation resistance between the wiring of an installation and earth should be of such a value that the leakage current may not exceed 1 by 50,000 the path or 0.02% of the FL current. The permissible voltage drop in a lighting circuit is 2% of the supply voltage plus 1 volt. The maximum permissible voltage drop in a power industrial circuit should not be more than 5% of the declared supply voltage. The insulation resistance of any wiring installation should not be less than 1 M and the earth resistance should not exceed the value of 1 Ohm. In an insulation testing using MEGA, we send a test voltage down through an electrical system to check if there is any leakage of current which is going to be passed through the insulated wiring of all the appliances of the machine. The MEGA supplies over 500 volts and that is enough to give a fatal shock. The cable that is to be tested may be used in AC lines and the MEGA uses DC as the testing voltage. Clamp the alligator clip on one of the mega probes to the wire or cable, touch the other probe to the exposed conductor and press the test button. The mega will generate a current between the probes and the meter will record the resistance of the jacket to the flow of the current. If you are testing insulation resistance to ground, place the positive probe on the ground wire or the grounded metal junction box and the negative probe on the conductor or terminal. Energize the mega for one minute. Read the value of the resistance at the end of the minute test and note it in your table. 
the wet leakage current test is an electrical bearing test on various electrical equipment to ensure it can withstand moisture or wetness from outdoor conditions this test is significant because it evaluates the solar panels insulation against penetration of moisture under wet environmental conditions weather conditions like rain morning dew or fog can lead to moisture penetration which can cause corrosion ground fault and electric shock hazard here comes the procedure to measure the insulation resistance in pv modules ensure you have all the following tools and equipment grid connected pv systems composed of multi crystalline silicon panels of 1 mw size systems with negative ground and floating ground for comparisons megometer connecting wires set of pv modules and water tank connect the megometer between the negative terminal of the string and the grounded support structure as shown in the figure connect the positive probe to the negative pole of photovoltaic string connect the negative probe to the support structure or ground cable set the megometer at 1000 volt dc operate the megometer for 2 minutes without the light measure the insulation resistance value and record measure and record the insulation resistance of each pv string repeat the test under hot and humid climatic conditions to compare the results record the observations please note that the leakage current test result is normally presented in the insulation resistance form for the easier testing and monitoring possible results the leakage current test of the pv string sampled of negative grounded and floating grounded pv systems typical results ensure you have all the following tools and equipment pv module water tank megometer and connecting wires the procedure to be followed to measure wet leakage current is as follows put the pv module inside the water tank connect the positive probe of megometer to the negative pole of the module connect the negative probe of the megometer to the support structure operate the megometer for 2 minutes without the light measure the insulation resistance to estimate wet leakage current record the observation sample of 20 modules for about 1100 modules in a mega plant are to be checked repeat the steps for all 20 samples and record the observations we have reached the end of this session on to measure insulation resistance and wet leakage current of pv modules by now you should be able to know about the insulation resistance explain the importance of measuring insulation resistance in pv modules know the significance of wet leakage current test measure the insulation resistance in pv modules and measure the wet leakage current of a pv module